of my review on the Polaris Sportsman 570 EFI. We got this back in 2014, and uh, since we've had it, we've uh, we we have worked it hard. We we uh, we we bought this the same way we bought this land, and uh, we have put in a few food plots and everything with it. We have used used this to pull out uh, with, on a trailer, pull out a um, trailer full of rocks, wood. We've got a few years of wood pulling it out with this. Um, I really have no complaints on it. It's been it's been hard working for us. I've uh, been talking to my nephew the other day. He said something. Well, I don't like it because of belts. My belt, you know, I've had no issue with this belt at all. I have never changed a belt on this machine. Um, like I said, I have taken heavy loads of rocks, wood, anything I can out of here, and I just had no issues with it. Though I there once in a while when and it's hot, it will get a little hot, but I've never had an issue with that. I think that a lot of things if you run it hard and low will get a little hot, so I, I, I haven't we pull a herald drag around with this. So if, I, if there's ever a complaint that I've ever had about this machine would be the design of the back bumper. Just because the, where bra the brackets that hold it on, they have broke a couple times and I've had to re-weld them. And uh, I don't remember ever hitting anything with them, but, they, but the, the brackets have broke. I like this box that we got for it. I have a winch that's got me out a couple times. I hardly ever really for overall. I have hardly ever used that winch, but I did get stuck a couple times and it pulled me out. But uh, the clearance on it is great. Um, it's got more than enough power for anything I've used it for. So uh, I wouldn't hesitate on ever buying a Sportsman 570. The new ones look awesome. I really like the, the pictures I've seen of the 22s or the 21s or anything with it in the bla all black. Uh, but like I said, this one is a 2014, and uh, like I said, I've had zero issues with it itself, and uh, it's been, really been a great machine, and I would really recommend them. Like with any machine, you really want to do regular maintenance on it, so uh, every couple of years we change the transmission fluid, uh, we change the differential once a year, and the oil every, you know, every so many miles, so uh, maintenance I think is the, high, the, the biggest part of these. Um, the only time I've ever had a complaint about these is hearing that people really take them and really beat them. I mean, that kind of goes with anything. So, uh, like I said, if you're going to buy a machine and you want it to work in your woods, work on your land, or uh, just for regular trail riding, it's great. So, uh, like I said, I truly recommend these. Four-wheel drive works great in four-wheel drive. I just re we had the same tires on it for whole time until this year. We put the, finally had to get new tires, but uh, I've had no other issues. Stay tuned for future videos on featured products, the habitat improvements that we make on our land, and the equipment we use to do it. So if you haven't already, subscribe to our page and like the video.